Recorded live in Austin, Texas, USA, it's The William Montgomery Show. Starring William Montgomery. With the Tony Chin Orchestra. The William Montgomery Junior Dancer. As always, William is joined by the lovely Erica. I'm Brett Erickson. And now, here he is. The Big Red Machine, William Montgomery. That, that gold wasn't recorded? Damn. Yeah, yeah shit. <laughs> God damn it, Matt. <laughs> we are recording now. Here we are with a brilliant, com- we've had a brilliant conversation a really already conversation. filled with hilarious jokes and stories and Grant wasn't recording it. <laughs> yeah, I can't believe it, Grant. And Grant, what did you say? People in the Middle East, you don't shake hands with your left you because you use your duty <laughs> that's your duty hand the left hand i i don't want to be on record of, oh, yeah, that's, not what call, that's what you're speaking for all middle easterners uh-huh. saying that no 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 i do not want to speak on behalf of all middle easterners <laughs> it's I, funny that i made think you that laugh so i i had some, <laughs> I had some <laughs> understanding of uh of, of customs that uh it, it could be perceived as rude if you shake with the wrong hand yeah i, th- I think that sounds you, right you should get into politics man because that's not what you just said before. Yeah, that's not what you were saying. <laughs> that's what I said. Confident. At least we're not recording. <laughs> you guys are making me sweat back here. Ooh, how you doing, Grant? I'm doing all right. Cool. Yeah, feeling good. How you, how, how about y'all? I'm great. Pretty doing good. good. There's a crash in front of us on the way here, and I have a pimple over my left eye today. I don't know how that happened. <laughs> I'll see if I can edit it out. Please do. Thank you. Can you do that thing where my face looks black? <laughs> I'm not gonna do that one. <laughs> or dark. That sounded kind of yeah. weird. Because it's not black. It's like a dark. We've already like alienated our fans in the Middle East with Grant's yeah weird c- takes on customs. I know. We don't I, I do not have it. a black face filter. Yeah. No. I wasn't asking for a black face filter. I was asking for that filter you did the other day. Oh, where I just yeah. Okay. Here I can do that. Yeah. So people know that I wasn't talking about. Can you put an eye thing. patch over his bad eye? Yeah, I had to get it. Ooh, there you go. I like that's that. kind of fun. Pimple be gone. Look at <laughs> my bald head is shiny when I at <laughs> my shiny head there. Okay, please take it off. That's too much. Thank you. How'd you get a pimple? What's happening? You got stress no... in your life? What is a pimple over the eye? I mean, stress. Well, pimples you sometimes pop out when you're stressed out. Really? Yeah. I don't know. I seem fine. I think I'm all right. I downloaded a new game. You're not supposed to touch it because your fingers are really oily. So, I need some Carmex wipes. (laughs) Did you ever use those? No. Carmex, is that right? Yeah, I don't know what the hell. Grant, what's going on? Why am I frozen? Hold up. Uh Oh Oh, no. no. (laughs) Uh oh. Right off the bat, technical difficulties falling apart. (laughs) Okay, you're back. You're back. It looks like they spent all their money on fake plants. Yeah, do you have some new plants in here? <laughs> Those have been there. I just you're usually sitting a little bit more forward. Oh, really? Yeah. I never noticed those nice. before. Yeah. Never noticed them before. So you're doing hot yoga after this. I am going to do hot yoga today. I've done yoga before, but I've never done this kind of yoga, which is going to be scary. Be real hot and it real hot yeah. in there. Yeah, they crank up the heat to like a 106 or something like that damn that's and i hot. i the last when i did do yoga just regular temperature yoga yeah i sweat like a pool of water onto my mat it's disgusting is your sweat salt all the other people in the class <laughs> yeah, yeah, I guess, i'm assuming it is it i've is. never sampled it i'm not a puppy yeah when i biked months ago i hadn't sweat in forever and it tasted extra salty yeah yeah. Well, we learned that's actually good for the flavor. <laughs> Maybe that was bringing out the extra flavors. It could have been. Yeah. Ooh, Are you I'm sore. Yeah, I'm real sore. I sir. I worked out twice this week. Really? Yep. I'm about to get real. Uh, what do they call it when you get real strong? Ripped. Yeah, I'm about to get ripped. Shredded. I'm about to get shredded. <laughs> I hit the. Stare- what if you did? What if you <laughs> just got like carrot top? Have you seen carrot? Yeah, top? that's too much. He no, looks you insane. Should, you should do that though. I wonder As if that would joke. negatively affect my comedy if I looked real strong. Just ripped. 
Do you think that what I think about that? At first, I thought I was hesitant to lose my giant gut because I was like, oh, the comedy's not going to be as funny. But now I think that's obviously for the positive, just health reasons. But yeah. What if you started wearing like a fake uh, gut out there? I could do that. That'd be funny. They have the fanny packs that look like tummies. Uh huh. I could do that. Yeah, I need to figure it out. I remember when I was working out a bunch in college, I would wear tank tops all the time. So maybe I can bring that back. Mm -hmm. I want them to try out for Survivor. <gasps> and I think they do it for a shorter amount of time because you have to quarantine first. Yeah, it's we'll same mill, same million dollar. I, he's I either he would re either. <laughs> Whoa, Grant! Yeah, that's how I want to look. I want my traps yeah. to look like that. Actually, what's tra your traps? What's traps one? are the things here? Oh, your neck. Yeah, your giant neck. Trape What's trapezius. There no, is. I don't know what it's called. What? Yeah, there. Oh, perfect. Perfect. <laughs> Grant, does that look like it's actually me? How, that looks like you. you how look, I think you... it does. <laughs> swole. <laughs> yes, yeah, swole. Yeah, your comedy. How? How could people not find that hilarious? I don't know. I mean, I think it would help your comedy. I think you should do it. Well, we'll see. Yeah, I've been. I hit the stairmaster for five minutes the first time, and then uh. uh huh. Felt like he was gonna. The faint. first day Tuesday, I thought I was having a heart attack in there, but I think it's because I haven't exerted physical energy in forever. <laughs> that must be it. I was breathing hard and I was feeling kind of dizzy. I was like, yeah. I'm about to drop dead in this in this place. Uh huh. But I think it's because I just hadn't done that in a very long time. Yeah, it's got to feel good though. After you're done, it feels good to work out, do some exercise. That's why I always like doing yeah. yoga because when you're done, you feel great. You know, I know it's been good. I haven't felt as bad laying around playing my video games after I work out. Yeah, it totally helps because before when I'm just not doing anything, only playing video games, then I start feeling like I'm going insane. What'd you do? The Stairmaster and what else? Do the Stairmaster and then I have the that uneven bar thing. It's like a bar that goes like that. <laughs> and then you put the weights on the end and then I have different uh, workouts that I used to do that I do where I lay down and then I'll. Do the bench press thing, and then I'll go down and like that, and then I'll do the that thing, <laughs> and then I'll stand up and do that, Girls. and then that. I do that all it's three. A good times. workout, dude. He was showing uh you, your friend Billy the other day all those moves he was doing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was asking Billy because it seems He's like that guy all. works out a lot. Billy is huge. Billy is shredded, as they say. Oh my god! And I told him about how I felt dizzy after after the fact after the stairmaster, and he told me the night before he was just leaning over stretching, and when he got up, he got dizzy and started having a nosebleed, and he thought he was having a stroke. Oh, my God. He's like, ah, oh, how are you doing now? Are you better? He said, yeah, I think. Oh, man. A little scary. Yeah. Well, he takes it too far. I mean, he, he, looks, like, he looks like what you just looked like when Grant put that body on you. That's his. That's Billy's, our buddy Billy's body. He's, yeah, he's like a scary-looking guy, but he seems very sweet. He's, he's a he's good like dude. Very sweet. Yeah, he loves working out, man. That's good. Sure. <laughs> That's good. So, yeah, we'll see how buff I can get. Yeah, man. That's cool. Yeah, we'll see. I feel better. I was feeling like I was going nuts, kind of. Uh-huh. Just you laying around. I wasn't doing shit. Yeah, you got to do something. I know. I get out there and take a walk. Insane. You ever go on walks? You don't like walking? We do we like have walk. before. Mm -hmm. We need to again. I mean, today it's so beautiful. Come out. Outside. You come out next time. Uh, Carrie and I go for our little walk around Lady Bird Lake. You can come with us. Cool. I know. It sounded like y'all see a bunch of people. We yeah, we're out there, man. That's cool. That sounds nice. yeah. It's nice. It's good to stretch out the old uh, legs, get the heart pumping. I know. I know. Yeah, I have my bike out on the trainer. Maybe I'll get on that later. There you go. Look at us. Ooh, Look at us. Things are looking up. <laughs> so healthy. New year. He got a Costco membership. Yeah, we got a Costco membership. Ooh. Got a Don't know why. Of beef jerky. Yeah, Eric has been second guessing the I'm like, Costco membership. I feel like it's membership. too much for us. I don't have <laughs> room. Second guessing it after I don't have she room was for kind of like more paper That's... towel rolls. We don't have room for that. Well, we have room for a big bag of beef jerky. We got a big <laughs> bag of beef jerky. That sounds delicious. We got heart shaped raviolis for Valentine's Day. Mm -hmm. That's nice. What How, else uh, we wait, now let's get into a the heart shaped dog. raviolis. How many cans of heart shaped raviolis do you it's have? It's two packets. 144? Two, yeah, it's oh. two pretty big packets. I like think it's like two packets. servings per packet or something. I could it's finish cute. off that whole thing. <laughs> yeah, we need to make some sauce or something. We still have the soup container in the fridge. We haven't made soup in a while. 
So got to figure it out. But yeah, I'm excited Costco. about the Costco. We got the five dollar uh, chicken. The rotisserie. Rotisserie chicken. Mm. So good. Yep. I like the H E B rotisserie chicken. We, or, Is that a good one? It's a good one. Yeah, yeah. Randall's had a good one. It's yeah. Just, on Mondays, there's a five ninety nine deal. You can tell that we haven't eaten yet today when we're recording. <laughs> yeah. we're I know. I haven't. Food. I'm starving. <laughs> I'm starving we haven't. right now. <laughs> I'm starving. I was doing some comedy stuff last night, and I had to shit the whole time. Yeah. And then I get back, and I don't have to do do anymore. So what? I was wondering what happened with that. Where'd it go? I yeah. Tell me about it. I so don't know. Have you did you this morning, or is it still in? There? A little bit. <laughs> Not as much as it felt like last night. Did you uh, did you uh, use the bidet after you were? Um, it's not done? installed yet. What? Yeah, you got to come help us install it. We got you a bidet for your birthday. It's still in the trunk of the car. <laughs> <laughs> it is. We have a Damn bunch it. of boxes in there. We need to. I need to get it out. Yeah, I just jumped in the shower like normal. It's super easy to hook up, but I'll come over and hook it up for you. Cool. Um, I'd be glad to. It's going to change your life, man. I'm telling you. Cool. Yeah, I believe you. It's going to be great. Because then I don't have to jump in the shower, but I kind of like jumping in the shower after. You I got used you to that. You still can. You just won't have to. And then the chunks won't come off. <laughs> like today, chunks came off. And it's weird. It smells like like uh, plaque in your mouth or something. What? Your Y'all ever notice that doo doo? Yeah. Your kind of smells his like poop smells like. Uh, <laughs> like what? Like not natural. Like what do you mean chemically not or something? Chemically. I don't know. It doesn't like s- Robocop. <laughs> something, something like that. Not human. <laughs> It smells like gasoline sometimes. Sometimes, yeah. I think maybe that's what it is. <laughs> Why is that? I feel like a lot of the times his does. I'm like, it doesn't smell bad, but it doesn't smell like. It's got that kind of like. I don't sweet mechanic sort of like smell. Like it's kind of bad, but kind of good. No, it's like a like mechanic. Gas, kind of like gas, you kind of want to smell it some yeah. more, but then it kind of makes you sick a little bit. Yeah, but yeah, you yeah. want to keep smelling it. God. That's your poop? Yeah, some of the a time. Of you the need time. to see a doctor, my friend. Do you think so? I do think so. That does not sound like anything I've ever heard of. <laughs> really? I've never heard. Like, no matter what, if someone tells you something's wrong with them, you can always think about how someone else told you about that or you've heard of that before. Yeah. <laughs> this is something I've never heard of before. Really? The only other time it was happening was I went to some crawfish boil in Memphis at a buddy's house one time, <laughs> and I ate some crawfish, and it must have been... A bad crawfish because my stomach was horribly fucked up, and yeah, it was a doo doo all the time, and it was real oily, and it smelled all weird. <laughs> it's the weirdest thing. I don't know what it was. Some yeah, bug it was oily, got in me. He said. A bidet will help you immensely if you ever get into a situation like that again. Cool, cool. Yeah, yeah I mean, I need something like that. It's right, been well, a real I'll, ordeal. I'll swing by and hook it up. Cool thing. You've never even seen our place before. I've never, I've never seen your place. Cool. What are your expectations coming in? Uh, well, I think, um, I expect it to be a little haunted. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Last night a door opened. So there's somebody living there. From the door opened <laughs> last night, and Erica was scared enough where she said, you're the man, you need to go check it out. <laughs> but I was laughing because I know why it opened. Why did it open? Because we had the back door open, and this, and... A ghost when the got in. draft comes in, that yeah, a ghost got in the back door. It was open. No, when the draft comes the door in, door opens. No, last that night. door moves like when the AC's on or for doors open. Yeah, it's a little door to like the heating <laughs> shed or something. It's like a smaller, oh, like a door. little closet yeah. with the with the heater, the mm-hmm. furnace, and the uh, water heater and stuff. In there. I was scared to look. And it, it popped in. open. It popped open. Yeah, that is where uh, ghosts like to hang out because it's, it's warm in there. Oh, sure. I know, and there's small spaces. I'm yeah, scared they like, to open it up to check it out, but nothing was inside, luckily. Well. That I could see. Maybe it was already gone. It opened the door. It took off. It could have been. It's still maybe in there or something. I don't know. Well, it's sad he's going to... We just got rid of our dinosaur blankets. Oh, yeah, we got a nice... We got adult uh, bedding. <laughs> yeah, I got some nice... Got a nice comforter, <laughs> but now it's hot. It's hot as shit. Got a good yeah. goose down comforter. Mm-hmm. So I have to sleep with my legs out of it because I get too hot. Yeah, I also, I don't understand, like, like Carrie Mitchell, she loves to have, like, a really big, thick comforter like that with a, in a really nice duvet. Yeah, we got a this. duvet cover. And it's amazing, but also, she sweats like crazy under that thing. I'm like, wouldn't it be better? Hot? 
She does get too hot. I know. But I always love sort of those blankets, there. but they don't work. It's like you have to you live know, in Alaska or something. Yeah, we don't live Do where you sleep underneath it. Yeah, but I always try to put like one leg out. <laughs> yeah, if you put a like, leg or two out, it, it makes it better like, somehow. Like if your leg is like an ice cube and the rest of you is sweating, like somewhere in the middle. You keep your shoulders out because yeah. typically you want your blanket to cover your yeah. shoulders, but it feels almost nicer if they're yeah, not. I keep both legs out. It seems like yeah. it's all right. Yeah, it's like the weather. You know, it's like there's a cold front and a warm front, and then right in the middle, it's the sweet spot. And maybe the they're nice spot. when you're like in a hotel because you have like the AC cranked. Uh huh. Could be, I don't know, but yeah, it came in the. So pack. you got new adult blankets. I know we got adult, really excited. excited. You got rid of your old dinosaur. It's the dinosaur blankets thing. that Erica got me when I was living in L.A. that I never. Because he had the on. same sheets for fourteen years. Oh my god! And they were they were green, but they were mostly gray with holes all over. I think the bottom portion was missing, and I was like, I am not sleeping. There's a big on rip this. in it. Mm -hmm. It was gross, but yeah, I was mainly sleeping on the mattress. But we talked about that. There was my, like the the body, my body spot on the mattress oh <laughs> from sweating and having nightmares and stuff. It's probably about the same color as you. Mm -hmm. you yeah, know? like it could be like your essence. It was down soaked into that thing. Well, we could still keep the sheets out. Yeah, they yeah, look kind of like emergency. That. Yeah. What's your favorite dinosaur? Oh, that's you a have one? Question. What's the kind with like the Long tail neck. that looks like a rock? Like a rock? Yeah. Like yeah. A, the one dinosaur. Stegosaurus? Is that a Stegosaurus? Maybe. Ankylosaurus. Like... I knew Grant would know. Ankylosaurus? Ankylosaurus. Ankylosaurus that has like the rock tail? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, those are pretty cool. You're just thinking about the land before time and whichever favorite Gosh. dinosaur you had. What was a was sad it movie. <laughs> Gosh, was it Littlefoot's mom dies? Littlefoot, yeah. By Judith Barcy, the girl that got murdered that we always talk about. She was, she was the, the voice. voice of Ducky? Oh, that's right. Ducky. Ducky. Oh, my God. Yeah, his dad murdered her ass. In the valley. Oh, maybe that's who's haunting your apartment because of your dinosaur blanket. It could be, yeah, the Ankylosaurus. That's it? That's my favorite. Yeah. What's your favorite? I was going to say uh, uh, Stegosaurus. Was that the tall one? I think no, that's the one I think that has like it's it has like the big like uh scales on yeah, its those tail, are cool. you know. But I don't oh, know. Yeah, and it has a spike tail. Spiked, yeah. You like rock tail, spike tail? Yeah, rock tail, spike tail. What's your favorite <laughs> kind, Grant? <laughs> uh I like the Stegosaurus as well. Yeah, I, just there put, he is. I just put one up on the screen. There's a stego. I wonder yeah. if those two were friends with each other. They probably hung out. They, they probably, probably had, did. had a podcast together. I wonder if they did. <laughs> yeah. Damn. <laughs> they could have. Yeah. What's your favorite one, Erica? The ones with the long necks. Was that a bron that brontosaurus? Yeah. I never. Brontosaurus. Grant, that's right, right? Yeah, brontosaurus. Yeah. How do you know so much? I knew he was. Because he has kids. How do you know so much about dinosaurs, Grant? Yeah, Dino Dan, Dino Dana, those oh, shows, I guess. Dino Dan and Dino Dana. Uh, have kids, you'll find out. <laughs> They're all all the rage with kids. We'll check it Some out. Some Canadian. Well, it's all, gotta all be kids better than are Canadian. It seems it's got to be better than what happened to me because when I was raising kids, the dinosaur kids show was Barney. <gasps> oh, Ooh, I, I love that. Barney. The purple oh. dinosaur. I love PBS. Man. I watched. I even saw Barney live. Oh my god. I went to Barney Live with my kids. How was that? Was that on ice? Nope. Were they skating? <laughs> no, well, they weren't even on ice. Damn. On stage. How was and that? It was uh, the little, uh, was the little yellow one. It was the little yellow one's birthday. TJ or something? Yeah. <laughs> Is that the yellow one? Yeah. Yeah. I love Baby Bob. Baby, Baby Bob. Bob. That was the other one. Jeez. Man, I used to smoke a lot of weed before I <laughs> would take my kids to Barney would or you? watch Barney. When would Barney you? came on, it was like, Dad's going to the basement for a minute. That's so funny. <laughs> and I'll be right back. Would it make it better watching it? Hell yes. Did they also watch the Teletubbies? We didn't do Teletubbies so much. I didn't mind Is that later on. I, I think don't later. Maybe, but I think it just you know they like what they like, and you know you're not pushing things on them if they don't like it. That's fine. Yeah. You know. I kind of liked the Teletubbies. That was kind of trippy. If you're high, <laughs> get high and watch <laughs> the Teletubbies. You can kind of get into it. Really? <laughs> yeah. That'd be cool. Yeah, I never did that. Yeah, they were scary, kind of. Freaky Telly world, Tubbies. man. Oh Look, God, there they so are. Cute. 
Grant, did you like them? Uh, <laughs> they, they were weird. It and was... the sweet little baby sun face. Yeah, the sun face. Grant, what's going on? Why does my face look so red in this? Is that really how my face looks today? <laughs> Uh, I, I mean, I did you do something to this? I added a little bit of a tan to you, but not much. You did? Wow, that's tan. This is scary looking a little bit. Grant. It's not. No, it's probably your monitor over there. It looks great over here. Does it really? You look. You look handsome. Aww. Oh my gosh, Grant! <laughs> stop, Grant. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> you look good, Grant. Now you're blushing too much. I shouldn't have said that. Oh my gosh, Grant. <laughs> that was sweet of you to say. Nice of him to say. <laughs> Grant. <laughs> oh my gosh, we're going to give you a big hug when I see you. Here, I'm going to fix it. There you go. There you're nice and, nice and pasty. Whoa, it did look different. You really can't. Now you look like now the fourth you... Teletubby. Yes, yes. I do. <laughs> <laughs> it's stinky. Tinky, stinky winky. Tinky. Tinky. Tinky winky. <laughs> Gosh, I did some weird show last night at the uh, Sunset Strip place. Uh huh. Have you been the there before? Sunset Strip Comedy Club here in Austin, Texas. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. I like Adam Hartle a lot. The guy uh, Adam's a good guy, man. Yeah, he's he very really nice. Is. He's too nice of a guy to be in this business. I can't see that he lasts. Yeah, I don't know how long he's been doing it, but he's too nice of a guy. I hope oh, he. Really? I hope he sticks around. Yeah, I remember getting fucked up. I don't mean to make it. Story. Yeah, I don't mean to make it sound like he's a flash in the pan in any way. But he yeah, did, he's it, a big fan of this show. He's going to be watching this. Adam, be I love careful you. what you yeah, say. I, he's great. He's such a nice guy. It's it, it's absolutely the exception to the rule, you know, in this business to have a guy like that. He's funny. Just the a, green room is in that RV in the back. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, that's perfect. Yeah, the red one. Stinky. Poe. Oh, Poe. Poe. Stinky's close. Poe. Po. <laughs> <laughs> that's po. what we call each other. Stink. Come on, Erica. What? We're getting into it. We call, call each other stink. Stinky. Come on. <laughs> Get into it. Let's he'll go. Walk in, he'll be like, hey, stink. Stink. <laughs> Come on, Erica. Give please. me a kiss, stink. <laughs> and i hope she kisses me recently she hasn't been so. uh oh why not <laughs> what's going on is it that pimple maybe that's why you're getting <laughs> no. pimples no I, that was just the morning he was mean to me i don't know I, sometimes so i'm I, mean in the morning he's mean and he's real mean in the morning i'm not always real mean in the i morning. texted that to carrie the other day i was like william doesn't want to come in and then i was like he's coming in he's just in a mood and i did a little shush emoji <laughs> See, now here's the, oh, so gosh. I just figured it out, dude. What? Here's what happened. What? Because I wasn't going to go like these bitches set us up. I mean, I'm always happy to hang out, but I was just <laughs> yeah. going to ha I was just going to be have a nice afternoon at home. Uh my lady was going over to hang out with Erica and Chica. They were going to do hair, they were going to do the whole thing. And then she's like, "Oh, William's coming too." And I'm like, Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, so you guys both were suckered. Yeah. So both of us got told that the other one was coming so that we would come along and they could ruin, basically I ruin our I told Gary he doesn't want to come in. He's in a mood. And then he, when he when we got there, he parked and he came in. And I was like, oh. Yeah, it was totally fine. He I was had a good thinking, time, well, Why don't too. you just drive over there? I right. was thinking it was going to be me by myself for four hours. Be nice, right? You could play a little vid. Yeah, I was just thinking. It was and then, nice to have some social time. And then I was speeding to the place, and that got Erica mad. I was driving crazy to the place yeah, on the expressway. Crazy. Uh -huh. Start hitting the gas real hard, <laughs> hoping one of the tires blows out. Yeah, he's a maniac. <laughs> just hoping one of those yeah. tires pops. Stinky. That'll teach you. <laughs> yup. We pop this tire. You'll fucking bad learn. Car crash. Yeah, we roll this bitch. Yup. Oh my gosh, did you ever see the movie uh, Enemy? Uh -uh. With Jake, Jake Gyllenhaal, one of my he, favorites. He oh, loves great. anything with Jake Gyllenhaal. Oh my gosh, you need to watch it. Ba there's Enemy. a bad car crash in it, though. Where they both Is died, that an A? Spoiler what is alert. A24 movie. Yeah, that's kind of a spoiler. I know, spoiler. <laughs> they both died. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, we're watching The Bachelor, and Erica does the spoilers on that one for me. Oh, yeah. the first day it starts, I Google who wins. 
Oh, that's no fun. Well, I now it's no fun. I still like it. It doesn't ruin it for me. Uh, I don't. I um, that's unacceptable. Well, because ABC even if, even if because it's ABC no, spoiled it already. They showed the top three already. So it's you. You can't have the other person watching something with you know the end because they do little clues that give it away, or they just it like you totally. both. You both have to be watching you totally it do. at the same. Phase. That's what I think. That's why I wake up in a bad mood. Yep. That's it. <laughs> I know now he fun. wants to pop yeah. his tire and roll yeah. the car. <laughs> yeah. All because you had to Google who won The Bachelor before yep. you ever watched it. <laughs> just want to slam into a bridge or buckman. <laughs> or a buttman. <laughs> However, you just slam Either into way, one of those. Yeah. Screwed when we hit it. Yeah. 60 miles an hour slamming into yep. one of those. That would probably be immediate lights out. Yep. <laughs> yep. And right after you get all ripped, shredded, be like, it's dead. Yep. Wasted your time. I wonder if I should start taking steroids. Doesn't that make you angry, though? Yeah, I think it does. Well, I need to lay off that, then. Yeah. Because I'm already really angry. (laughs) I'm already really pissed. (laughs) No, that's why it's been good. That's why it's been good working out, though. Yeah, super sore. Well, here's the thing. You keep working out. I'll check out this yoga. And then next week we'll get some. We'll get you. You ever done yoga? Never. It's it's just stretching. It's yeah, a, that's what I it's, thought. It's a way to do stretching that allows them to charge you. You know, fifty dollars. Yeah, a session how expensive or is it? It's like twenty bucks a session or couple, it know, is it, something like that. Did you go to that room the other night where they destroyed televisions? The rage room. Did you, yeah, go? Did you go? No, I did not. Oh, that seems no. dangerous. It is. It's. it's it does seem dangerous. I mean, hopefully we're in goggles and stuff. Right? They they put you in a whole bunch of uh, uh, protective gear. I feel yeah, like I'd pull a muscle if I didn't break anything. Yeah, oh. yeah, you'd have to stretch before you're doing that. Mm-hmm. But we'll get you into a yoga class. We'll get you all stretched out after you work out. It'll feel good. It will. Mm-hmm. I pray to God it does. Pretty soon I'm not you'll doing be doing good. Doing one of those like you know poses like that you'll be all super balanced and you'll have you'll be ripped you'll have a six pack yep you'll be I'll have clear my traps headed, going clear headed yep everything will be good be unstoppable namaste man. big bag of heart shaped ravioli yep <laughs> i'm looking forward to that when are we even going to eat that i don't know do you want to make some later yeah i mean i'm starving <laughs> i'm starving <laughs> right now i'm super hungry too because, yeah, I have. I've been working out some, and I just haven't been eating as much. But then I think, oh, do I have some eating disorder? But I think I was just, no, no I don't think at all. I think I was just eating a ton of food, yeah. and now I'm just totally not eating as much. That's what I'm trying to do, too. And now it's almost easier. I think my stomach has shrunk or something. Good for you. That's what I got to get to. I'm in, I'm in the phase of always thinking about it. Really? Yeah. I'm thinking about it right now. Yeah, it's all good. I just get, yeah, I get all angry and then I punish myself. I'm like, you're not going to fucking eat today, William. You're not fucking eating today. That's what you get. Yeah, you piece of shit. I don't really, yeah. I don't really think that way, but kind of. Well, you look good. (laughs) You look good. It looks good. Thank you. I was just doing so bad, so. Yeah. It's generally better. We're super healthy right now. We got a great show today. I know. Really excited about... uh, We'll figure out the logistics, but uh, our guest Nathan. Yeah, I have guest Nathan and Jason Rouse drove him. Yeah, because I think Nathan is staying with Jason. Uh huh. Two maniacs. Two, two total maniacs. Yeah, two sweethearts, maniacs, whatever you want to call them. They're both. They're both of those things. They both are both of those things. Jason is one of those guys that when you see his act, you're like, oh my god. He's so funny. He's a maniac. We watched he's him the in same movie. way and he's, off stage. He is, but he's also super sweet and not. Well, yeah, he's yeah, yeah. For you. He, every one of these Canadians who comes down to Austin stays with Jason because he's just like, yeah, stay at my house. I don't care. I know. He's he's that guy. He's great. Which is funny. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So that should be fun with uh, those two. I don't know Nathan's last name, or I would have said it. It's Nathan. It's Nathan. Yeah, you know Nathan from Kill Tony. Yeah, Nathan from Kill Tony. There you go. That'll be fun. I know it should be a lot of fun. Uh, so we will see them in just a second. So you're, uh, so you've got a lot of anger. You're trying to crash the car. A lot of anger. Uh, not really. I'm kind of kidding. Yeah. 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 But I mean, we all feel that sometimes, right? We do. I think that's a natural human, uh, thing. Yeah. 
Yeah. Isn't I, it Grant? Definitely. A little bit of a uh, road rage. Well, you heard what Grant, you heard all the things Grant was saying about the people from the Middle East no. before we was even. Yeah. <laughs> oh not, my that God. That was shocking. Unbelievable. That was shocking. I was like, what is going on with this guy? He seems like a nice guy. And now he's saying this stuff. Like, this guy's out of his mind. I think some shocking. sometimes just like, you know, the discussions we have on the show, I can find stress me out. Oh, really? Oh, really? Like this one? Yeah. It like builds up my anxiety. Well, Grant, have you ever tried uh, using our friends at BetterHelp? Oh, you mean this this graphic right oh. here? Oh! <laughs> oh my gosh, Grant! That was good. Man. How'd you do that? I, I'm just a wizard. True. Damn. Mm-hmm. Yeah, BetterHelp's great, though, because, uh, you know, I, I have friends who uh, are in therapy, and they love it, and, it's, and it does a great job uh, for people. And I have other friends who need to be in therapy and Ooh. aren't. But the thing about uh, therapy is it, it it can be expensive. It yeah. can be difficult to to find the time to do it. With BetterHelp, you don't have to worry about any of that because it's on your schedule. Uh, you can do it on the phone. You can do a video chat. You can do all of this. You can do it from anywhere. So you don't have to be tied to going into an office. There's no waiting room. No looking you know? for parking. All of it. It's a hassle, and then that just adds to your stress. So with BetterHelp, you don't have any of that. So you've got these licensed, experienced therapists who are uh, literally at your beck and call. Seems a lot more convenient. Yeah, how do you even find? I don't even know how you find one. Well, that's it. You'd have to like you know you need to have somebody recommended to you, or what do you open up the yellow pages to find a therapist? I wouldn't know how to do that. Yeah, I wouldn't either. the The one my parents made me go talk to you many years ago. He, I think he was he had an office at the uh, Memphis Jewish Community Center. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I had to. I went to the Jewish Community Center. Yeah, well, that seems like a perfect fit for you. It was. I remember lying on the thing about my drug usage. Yeah, I pretended. How old like were I'm, you? What am I? Thirty five now. Maybe when I was twenty two. Yeah. <laughs> they had to get you straight. Yeah, Your yeah. parents were like, man, we got to straighten this kid out. Yeah, they were worried. Maybe the Jews can help. Yeah. <laughs> it was only two times I talked to the guy, though. With the rings? Yeah, yeah he wore rings. It was just weird. Yeah. See? So maybe on better health, you don't have to, better yeah. help, you don't have to worry about people wearing the ring. Nobody creeping you out like that? You yeah, know what I mean? You probably can't even see their hands. Probably not. So you don't have to worry about that part. Absolutely. That is absolutely correct. And uh, it, it, it's more affordable. <laughs> uh, Therapy is expensive, but BetterHelp isn't. So uh, if and it, it's a licensed therapist, you right there. Uh, you can set up your appointments, meet with somebody, pick through a bunch of people, and decide who's best for you. Talk to some different people. It's great. Yeah, I mean, I couldn't be the only one who fantasizes every now and then about running into a bridge abutment. Right. So if you happen to be one of those people, maybe talk to somebody at BetterHelp. Yeah, that's right. Maybe you it see, a, you. you know how you see on the roadway, you'll see where they put up those like guardrails with like the barrels of like water and stuff behind the guardrail. Ooh, how fun and then would sometimes that... you'll see one just completely caved in. Yeah. That's somebody who didn't call better help. Without a doubt. Definitely. So I wonder how it would be hitting those barrels filled with water. They'd probably slow your car down, but you'd still probably, it'd be yeah, a jerk. It'd still be bad. Yeah, probably mess up your car. Pretty much. <laughs> yeah. Probably destroy your car. Yeah, don't destroy your car. Yeah, get destroy your anxiety with better help. Yeah, don't destroy your car. Destroy your anxiety with better help. <laughs> Visit betterhelp.com slash WMS. That's better H-E-L-P. And join the over 2 million people who have taken charge of their mental health with the help of an experienced professional. In fact, so many people have been using BetterHelp that they are recruiting additional therapists in all 50 states. Special offer for William Montgomery Show listeners. Get 10% off your first month at BetterHelp.com slash WMS. 10% off. And you can take that money, get right to the Costco, get a big old jar of jerky. <laughs> jar jerky or jar. We got some blueberry jelly, too. Oh, that's good. Looking forward to that. You know what? I'll bring you a little bit. I got from, when I was back home in Illinois, we went to this place. Uh, this little farm, uh, apple farm kind of orchard place. Ooh. Apple farm kind of orchard. An apple orchard <laughs> apple is another orchard. name for that. Uh, and they have some great food. I have uh, uh, some raspberry jalapeno 
jam. Ooh. Ooh, how was that? Oh, ho, ho. it's the perfect mix. So it's sweet and spicy. It's got that little kick at the end. It's great. I'll Interesting. Bring I'll bring you some when I uh, hook your bidet up tomorrow. Sounds like that could be good on toast. Mm-hmm. We'll have a little bit of toast and jelly, and Woo. then what? We'll have a nice, a nice poo at the end. I can show you where the which door opened. Oh, shit. Maybe I'm coming can... over during the day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't come over. At no night. way. No, we don't recommend anybody coming over at night. So, uh, uh, let me ask you this: How's the uh, not smoking going? It's been good. I bought a pack, or somebody gave me a pack of cigarettes a week ago, and I still have it. That's good. Last night I maybe smoked four, whereas normally on a night like last night I would have smoked a pack. Yeah, well, especially because when you're performing. You get you always want a cigarette before because you're just like gives you something to do and kind of calms yeah. you down a little bit. And then after, when Not I still smoked, after. when I still smoked, that was the best one. The right after you got off stage, cigarette was incredible. Yep. So yeah, that's the toughest. That's the toughest. <laughs> but if you've gone now a whole week, you're still on the same pack. That's pretty good. Yeah, not a pack a day. So. Yeah, so it's good. But yeah, the uh, Lucy stuff, the little... Thank you, Grant. I thought that was a little late on you doing that, but that <laughs> Sorry. still worked. There you go. Uh, yeah, no, it's honestly been great. I mean, now, who knows what will happen with my mouth. I'm sure generally it's much better than smoking, I would imagine. Yeah, I know. Your mom, yeah, I don't think we have to... Let's not worry about that yet. Let's get you off of cigarettes. Yeah, let's first. get off of cigs first, which is happening. It honestly has uh, been great. I'll pop in one of my games and put one of the things in my mouth, and I'll just go to town for a couple hours. Mm -hmm. Now, the other day when uh, when you were uh, – oh, it was when we made the uh, the lobster mac and cheese. You uh, ate some of the lobster mac and cheese, and you forgot that you had your Lucy pouch in there. I did, so I gave the lobster mac and cheese a nice sort of minty flavor. <laughs> <That's> a... <laughs> so maybe that's a new thing people could try. Maybe try you it can out. eat some food. Maybe a you... peanut butter, Reese's peanut butter cup situation. I know. They have one that I like, the mocha one. So maybe that could be good if you were eating some ice cream or something. It could taste like a Jamocha shake from Arby's or something. It really is effective in... Uh helping you get off of cigarettes though i mean that's been a fact that's that's what this yeah, is what you've really been is. using and you have really really cut down on the amount of cigarettes you smoke and that's impressive without a doubt it totally yes this has honestly helped out because you yeah, feel smoking... like do your lungs feel better at all or does it have you noticed any of that yeah my lungs don't hurt as much when i was on the uh because I started working out a little bit a couple months ago, and I'd be on the Stairmaster, <laughs> and my throat would be hurting, my uh -huh. lungs. So it was not like that. I'd still smoke weed before I walk in there and stuff, so I get a little bit of that uh -huh. in my throat. But yeah, it seems like already the uh, cardio is doing a little better just because all of that smoke isn't going into my lungs, I would imagine. Well, that's great. And they have a, they have flavors you like Mocha and mint. <laughs> Ooh. Listen to him cough. <laughs> now I'm coughing. <laughs> uh, yeah, the... What's your favorite? Espresso and cinnamon. Ooh. I yeah, like I was that. wrong with the mocha. It's espresso that I like. That sounds fantastic. See, because listen, good. I'm a basic bitch. Yeah? <laughs> I like pumpkin spice. Ooh. And that's essentially cinnamon. Let's not lie. It is. So... I don't even smoke. Maybe I. <laughs> what if Maybe I got we hooked get on, you on this? Get hooked on Lucy pouches, and then I got to start smoking to get off of the pouches. Yeah, that sounds good though. Actually, espresso and and uh, cinnamon. Yeah, they're pre they're pretty good. Hell I yeah. have one in my mouth right now. Really, you can't nope. tell. Good for can't you. Even tell. That's pretty badass. Check out Lucy's full line of products at Lucy.co. That's Lucy.co, and use promo code WMS at checkout. It helps this show if you use my promo code. I think that it's possible that you were supposed to be reading this. It helps the show <laughs> if you use the promo code WMS. Also, you've seen the disclaimer. Warning, this product contains nicotine. Nicotine is an addictive chemical. Keep that yeah, in mind, William. I know, I know. It's addictive. I know. 
Super addictive, but it's better than smoking. We all already knew that it was addictive. Nobody's... Yeah, I think people know that It is better. So if you're interested in a better way to quit smoking and a better way to use nicotine, visit lucy.co and be sure to use that promo code WMS. WMS. Use that fucking code. Smash that code. Smash that code. WMS. When you're getting your cinnamon dip things. (laughs) Smash WMS when you're doing it. Yep. Just remember that part. That's it. Yep. Just remember that part of it. <laughs> WMS. God damn it. Raising bread! Ooh, Ooh look right at the background. Step. Yeah. All right. Hold yeah. on. Oh, yeah. How's it going? Oh my god, I'm nervous now. Yeah. The sun's falling. Jason, please. I know, I know. I try. You know, I think I, 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 I'm so. It might cross come across as a negative um, grimness about myself. Yeah. Uh, I know it hurts your heart. Sometimes. A little bit. I'm glad you don't have any devil stuff on today. You do have that <laughs> scary double baby shirt i what? did i brought a knife because i might carve a pentagram into my asshole before the end of the show <laughs> okay well my so parents watch it. this so right. please seriously <laughs> grant's back there grant i don't want to hear this grant is and all the okay <laughs> thank y'all so much for being here we have jason and jared Hello. double j's from canada two canadians hey yes what's your best canadian like accent you talk, we're hey? Jared. What's your best Canadian accent? A boot, eh? <laughs> you just got got back to America. How is it up in Canada? Communism. Is it? It's like communists. Communists. You can't even see people's faces. How come? They have face masks everywhere. Oh. Ask for ID everywhere. Everybody's scared. Everybody's yeah. Was it hard to get out of the country? It was all right. It wasn't the hardest time. What do you do? Just like find some forest path and walk through like... Largest unprotected border in the world, the Canadian border. So you could probably sneak in pretty easily. I was hitchhiking in Niagara uh-uh. Falls. So Were you Por- really? Portage. Were you really? For this show, let's say I did. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> God, that was gonna scare me, Jared. I, you don't need to be hitchhiking. And I just found out you've never driven, Jason. Yeah, I've never driven a car in my life. Uh, I did confess to that time in 1991 when I was arrested for running down the highway naked uh, on a long Canadian Day long weekend. Bottle of Crown Royal and about twelve Budweisers in a boat, and it gave me. <laughs> did I? Did you get it? Oh my god! Is that one? I heard it. I heard oh, it. Shit. I get my health care back. <laughs> yes. So Jared, I always ask people, Jared, both of y'all, I know Jared is staying with you, Jason. First off, yeah. how's that, Jared? He did. He did months before with me. Yeah, it's, it's, it's tough. Is he nice? Jared is Jason nice? <laughs> in an army sergeant kind of way. Yeah, right? In an oh army God. sergeant kind of way. It's... You look like an army sergeant right now yeah. for some, I don't know, some sort of satanic yeah. deal. <laughs> well, you got to, this fucking two-headed monster here, you got to bring in the big guns just to get it. Yeah. But yeah, it's a drill sergeant situation, but he he knows it's a means to an end and for sure we always have a conversation like he's very uh self-aware enough to know that uh i can be very curt and to the point but that's because we don't got time to waste he's on a very limited window yeah Jared, and he has certain a... things that he has to execute while he's here and land on his yeah. feet everybody's watching this is super important and there's at a time now where there's no second chances here and Tell me about it. I've game. been saying that for a year now. Yeah. There's no second chance. No. Yeah, this is it, man. There's no second chance. There's no second this chance. Time. Nope. No. Not There's for no him. There's no second chances this time. You can't be doing you doing comedy for four or five years in Canada. You show up in Austin. Yeah, in a, there's in a no room more full... fucking second, no second chances, chances, Jared. You agree, right? I agree. He knows. Yeah. Yes, he knows. I agree. No he knows. fucking, no second, fucking chances. second chances no this second time. No second chances. You don't There's get it. really not. Tony, <laughs> Tony don't give no repeats. No second no. chances this time. 
Jared, what did Jason feed you for breakfast today? What did he hasn't eat? eaten? God, I got we about... haven't eaten either. I'm just starving. <laughs> yeah, I'm hungry too. Yeah, I'm really oh, hungry. hungry. I'm, I'm hungry. starving. I'm starving. Right I, now. I brought it up, and because he said he has problems, he has uh, food problems. What do you mean food problems? <laughs> <laughs> He's got food. Jared, problems. what do you mean you have food problems? If there's food he does in front of me. I have to eat it. Okay. Yeah, but he that's eats a food same, problem. He'll eat like, the whole, same thing. Obsession. Raisin bread for a month. That's your problem. No, this bullshit. I wasn't actually doing that. That was all a big lie. <laughs> What's the lie? Yeah, I well, don't like that, fucking feels raisin bad. bread. I told him that you have the same kind of thing, but now you're telling well, them. No, were... Jared, I do have the same kind of thing. Don't I say have... that. <laughs> yeah, raisin <laughs> bread. I do have the same kind of thing. No, no, no. no. I'm, uh... What's yeah, the grossest have... thing you've eaten for the longest period of time? <laughs> that's a good question. I have, well... <laughs> and don't go pussy, because that's my line. I eat. Tim Hortons breakfast sandwiches. Hold on, pause there. These hey, these Tim people. Hortons. I ate a, a Canadian uh, I ate like Dunkin' Donuts. Canadian diner. Breakfast sandwiches. For a whole Hold week. on, get your face closer to the mic. I don't think anybody's gonna be able to hear. No one talking really what, low. What the fuck is going? Hey, have you? No. Ever, look at you. Look at you. you. Can't take me anywhere. Look at you. Look at you. <laughs> You're a second chance. Grant, get this background off. Why does he have goldfish on it? You know he's allergic to shellfish. Uh, yeah, you Grant, you know he's yeah. allergic to goldfish. Do you read your messages, Grant? <laughs> we sent you, yeah. We, sent we had a whole head. thing. I gave him a breakdown. Go he's gold not supposed to have goldfish. Goldfish eat what's ever in front of him. Oh! oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Grant with the Redeemer. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah. Pancakes. We're back to pancakes. Yeah, you can have yeah. pancakes. Oh, oh. oh tell, <laughs> tell him the little scam you ran at IHOP, you fucking asshole. What'd you yeah. do at IHOP? He stiffed a waitress making minimum wage Bullshit. with a fucking no, breakfast uh, bill at mom. four in the morning. He did some fucking, what were you do? Some homeless guy spit in your mouth and you freaked out? And went and ate IHOP for free and then said his Canadian debit card didn't work and Let walked Jared out. Let Jared tell the story. Out. What's Can going go on in? here? Can I go all in the story? What is yeah. Jared allowed to do? He talk? ripped off uh, a, 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 like a, a late night shift lady Can I do for the her Coyote, money. The whole story? No, just yeah. what happened at the IHOP? Why'd you stiff the waitress? <laughs> wow. I was at Coyote Ugly before oh. I went to IHOP. Is that the bar with the ladies who dance on the stage? Yes. And um, I went over my credit card limit, <laughs> and then afterwards I went to fucking IHOP, and he got I had robbed, and then pancakes. we ate pancakes to feel better about himself. And um, oh. I went to pay for it, and it declined. Were and you horrified when that happened? Yes, I was. Panic, but yeah, I would have been. I was panicked. kind of panic, <laughs> but I, I would have been too. Explained, I'm from Canada. They told me it was okay. It's funny how you can use Canada over yeah. all the list of th ailments that you have. You go, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm Canadian. 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 Like, I'm Canadian. 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 Canadian, right out of here. The Canadian card worked. It, the <laughs> other card did not work. But Are you telling me that being Canadian is more special needs? Than what you got going on. Yeah. Is that a form of like a, a handicap? You really is that really a thing? I mean, it sounds like you, you can use it. I've used it before. I'm sorry. I'm Canadian. Yeah. You okay. really have? I have. Yeah. I got away with it. Or, I've got so do y'all like it. being from Canada? Not do you right. ever lie to people or do you always say no, you're from I was Canada? From Canada? Especially I'm a traveling. I think I'm from Canada. Yeah. Yeah. I own it. Why not? Hey. Right. Why not? I hey. agree. Well, I mean, people can tell just from looking at you. Yeah, you're a host. You know what I mean? Yeah. You look like you Bobby and Doug face. McKenzie. I'm you know what I mean? Who are Bob and Doug McKenzie? <laughs> Strange Brew? Rick Moranis? No, uh, sorry. Um, Rick Moranis and yeah. Dave Thomas. Yeah, yeah Thomas Dave Thomas and, Thomas and Rick Moranis. You yeah. don't know? Dave Out of all the yeah. slanders you said about Not the Rick Moranis? Wendy's guy. <laughs> Not the Wendy's guy. Like, you talk a lot of shit about that guy. <laughs> yeah, well, He was I'd... in Ghostbusters, asshole. Yeah, I forget yeah. about that. I just remember him from the movie where he shrinks his Yeah, but that wasn't even a good one. <laughs> yeah, that was a pop. You were too old to be a fan of that anyway. Oh, Not really. What year did it come out? 89. And how old were you in 89? Two. That's perfect yeah. for a movie about shrinking no, kids. No, you were a simple child at two. No, I was actually really smart. 
And from early on. <laughs> really? Yup. What, what? Uh, oh, sorry. Seriously. Professor. I just yeah. thought it was a haircut. I didn't know it was a lifestyle. No, it's a lifestyle. Yeah, I was really. <laughs> you smart are smart. From <laughs> That's it. Yeah, what yeah. What were you good whole... at? Yeah, what were you good at growing up? Ice cream mostly. <laughs> Gosh. <laughs> can, can, can I eat out of things? I don't know. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Don't be fooled. Look, we're all big fans of Jared and stuff, but he is a bit of, of a grease weasel. What do you mean getting out of stuff? Like a. Uh... Tree house Fucking heavy or... lifting. Like any chore, work. People always <laughs> want to help? help me, right? Yeah. People always want to get me fat? out of situations. Like... So from early on, people were helping you get out of situations. Yes. Yeah. I, oh, oh, poor I try Jared. to own things, and people tell me, oh, Ooh. let me help you. Let me do this. Okay. <laughs> yeah. You know? I'm trying to take a piss over here, but if you want to get my zipper down... Use your teeth. I don't like the eye contact. Gosh, no. Sorry, I'm in. It's too hot. Are you hearing this, Grant? Grant? Is I Grant, did hear this. Uh, um, a Christian man? His kids watch this. Oh, really? Well, <laughs> not anymore. Grant, do- are you a Christian person? Mm, no. Well, neither is Jason here. No. no. Okay. Are you Jared? No. I'm actually Jewish. All right. Show's over, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Let's shalom salute this asshole out of here. <laughs> you didn't tell me that. <laughs> Stop. I know you're kidding, Jason. No shit. I know you're kidding. <laughs> I've hijacked this poor man's life. I know you're and kidding. put are, him here. You shouldn't even be around. These eat? are all high-level professional comedians. You've been doing comedy for four years in Canada. Who gives a fuck? Well, now they I do. Should stop. We're not going to do I this give a here. Fuck. I know. I don't even drink anymore. Yeah, <laughs> now now you made them give a fuck. <laughs> he went back to Canada as a uh, legend, and uh, he's going to blow it all at the Red Rose this weekend when you can watch him. <laughs> God, no, Jason, no, no. stop. No, he's, he's got problems. Food problems. Addiction, I think you're food doing addiction. Good, I have issues. I have issues. He's doing great. But yeah, yeah, I think all, you're I'm, doing good, Jared. Who doesn't? And also, I think you could drive a car. You were telling me earlier out I, there that you haven't. Have you ever seen? I think you I could. have drove a car. Yeah. The, the, out of that experience, I'll never drive a car again. Was it not a good first experience? I just couldn't. Too many things going on at the same time. Yeah. And yeah. So what'd you do? Hit the gas. <laughs> I was what scared to hit the that gas. I was scared to hit the, the gas. gas. He just Could... locked up on the brake. Yeah. <laughs> I've seen so many <laughs> movies of people hitting the gas and just running through things. And... Yeah, like walls and yeah, stuff. Yeah, and I was afraid of that happening. So I kind of psyched myself out of it. So you just had your foot on the brake the whole time. <laughs> yeah, and also, I. Yeah. I can't do two things at the same time. I can't have one put on a brake and a gas. Yeah, you're not supposed to drive that way. But whatever. You're supposed to drive it to one foot. Yeah, I can't do, I can't, I couldn't do the one foot Well, you gave it a try. It sounds like it's good you're not driving. No. You gave it a shot. Yes. (laughs) And plus, I can't trust my anger, so. Two things. Yeah, Yeah, you said you'd have really bad road rage. What would you do, get in fights with people? I don't like st- I don't like stupid people. Yeah. Oh, this is awkward. <laughs> I don't I don't, I don't like I don't way like... to find out you tell me you're a Jew and now you hate me. <laughs> I don't like stupid people. And I don't like like yeah. I don't like this people... is more of yeah. an intervention. So you don't like stupid people and you don't like what other kind of people? I like I like all kinds of people. The, yeah, the, especially stupid people I don't like. I hear you, and there's a lot of stupid people out on the roadways. Yes. Out on the roadways. Yes. There's a bunch. <laughs> I said road rays. Road rage with the road rage. Road rage on road the roadways. Road yeah. Yup. <laughs> road <laughs> rage on the roadways. Yeah. <laughs> the only thing that's missing from this is puppets. You guys know that. Well, Grant actually is bringing some out in a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> oh, is he? I'm Isn't that right, Grant? Still sewing. I'll, I'll, I'll try and wrap Still it up. Sewing. Nice. Baby Jesus puppet. Better known Gosh, as Daddy's Jason. Fleshlight. Gosh, Jason. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. 
I like to take a... Uh, so Jared, what is Jason doing when y'all are just sitting in his apartment? What are y'all doing? Yeah, I know. It's terrifying. <laughs> Do y'all watch TV? I came, Do y'all talk I came to each to other? I can't even see what happens. I can't even share what happens too much. No, but... Um, it's not as bad as you think. I'm yeah. sure it's good. Yeah, I'm It's curious. not bad. It's a Twilight Zone. <laughs> yeah. Need the comedy channel. Okay. You need a Rocky Horror Picture Show. Sounds fun. Yeah. Need. Fun. Yeah. It just. It just. Oh, and you see. Like you all watch famous. all of those things. How many saying? times yeah. have you seen people scream in I my? Toilet like. How, oh, wow, wow. how many times have you seen people scream in my building? Remember oh, when they at the mailbox? Yeah. For people screaming people at the mailbox. People scream when I'm in the hall. I when I'm in the hallway. When he comes in, a people are man. shocked and scared. Some and old my, guy really? my neighbor today actually screamed like ah yeah, uh, <laughs> yeah he totally went on. The old guy went the ah <laughs> yeah the baby walked in. Well, Why is the guy scared of you like that? <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> what do you mean that him? I just have him. I have black clothing on. That's yeah, it. That's the only thing different. I think you guys are more terrified. But all the time. You always wear the black clothing. I have to. In I don't fact, have anything. I was uh walking around Ladybird Lake with my lady <laughs> uh, a couple of days ago. <laughs> And all of a sudden, this black figure, this dark black blur just went running past yeah. us, and it frightened us, honestly. Yeah. We were very scared. <laughs> what is this thing? It seemed like it moved like in an uh, unhuman sort of way, yeah. and it was this maniac jogging <laughs> in all black, yeah. weird With sort of outfit. Yeah, no, weird, no, whatever no. it is. Long. Oh, yeah, everything's covered. Yeah. Everything's covered. Were you wearing right. a cap and sunglasses? Cap yeah. and sunglasses. Uh, hood. Sunglasses. Good. The only part of my face is here, and my hands. That's the and only either thing. Either he was it. wearing, uh, either he had earbuds in, or he was just ignoring us because we were yelling, I had "Rouse, I Rouse!" Had and he just kept right on running like okay. some sort of weird it's like he just planted Terminator a pipe machine. Bomb somewhere. Yeah, I'm trying to. It looks <laughs> like you could have just planted a pipe bomb <laughs> yeah. somewhere. Yeah, I know. I got running school off. shooter. <laughs> I do a workshop down at the Y. <laughs> Uh, what? <laughs> yeah, no. Uh, I, listen, it's all very breathable, lightweight stuff. But so I don't run really, it. That's what he tells the people that he uh, kidnapped. <laughs> you can breathe through this. I. It's a. It's a <laughs> Mister. That's a cash bag. <laughs> you can breathe through this. <laughs> yeah. No, I have to go outside, but I don't want to be in the sun. You guys are white. You know what's going on. Mm -hmm. What do you get? Freckles. Uh, I always had freckles. What do your arms look like? Uh, my uh, <laughs> what do your all, arms all, look like? All your that's gray. Your arms? No, but let this... me see what's going on with your arms. Do the sleeve up. So there's no freckles, but there's two types of freckled people in my family. Yeah. There's the people that are uh, ha uh, more hard on the red mm -hmm. freckles, and those people have freckled arms. And then there's the brown freckle, which I think is melanoma, is what I got. <laughs> And uh, we don't Jared, get freckles. What's he on talking the about? Like you get freckles on your <laughs> no, back. Cancer? I don't. Get, I know that's scary. I don't get freckles on my back or arms. So where do you get them on your tummy? Just on my face. <laughs> I don't get them on my tummy. You don't get them on your tummy. I don't think I've ever said the word. Jared, tummy. do you? <laughs> do you get freckles on your tummy? No, no you he, have some freckles on I your arms. Freckles. Yeah. He gets dry skin around his belly button from blowing loads across his own chest. Cut. Yeah, Grant, edit <laughs> that out. Situation. Yeah, that's a sticky situation. <laughs> Grant, yeah. please tell Jason to stop. He really shouldn't have said that last part. I panicked. Grant, I had to go into my own toolbox. He doesn't have headphones on. He can't hear me. I'll behave. You Guess should what hear my... what Grant is saying about you right now. <laughs> yeah, I get it. Oh my it's, gosh, no, I can... it's great. Grant, Keep going. stop. I Keep could going. tell immediately as, as soon as I shook his hand that uh, it wasn't going to go well. Did he shake uh, with his left hand or his right hand? <laughs> no, we because... got a proper yeah. right-handed shake. Okay. I don't think. <laughs> Ooh, good. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. But Grant he was did... actually talking about Muslim people earlier, and it... and he oh, did this weird. with his hand on his <laughs> pants after he shook my hand. He went like this. He wiped. He woke like ew. I don't want to take this back to my family. What, do you have sweaty hands? No, I've got the curse of Satan. Jared, do you have and sweaty his, hands? Your next child will be born with a lazy Ooh, hand. you do. So do you. Fuck yeah. Yeah, so do I. <laughs> <laughs> you have a towel to wipe it off? Yeah, does somebody have a towel? Oh, hey. Holy hey, crap. Hey, so Jared, bring in some more greasy white guy. Holy. I didn't know you had sweaty hands, too. Are you nervous? I make you nervous? 
Okay. Do I, I just make have naturally oil? sweaty hands. Okay. Do you too? It smells like Cool Ranch Doritos. Bit. Yeah, <laughs> it was wet feeling yours, and yeah. I think that's how other uh, people okay. feel my hand. Jason. Not again. Not again. Feel my hand. First of all, how long are you playing flamenco, flamenco guitar with your nails? I'm growing them out again. Do you Why would you have to bring that up? I thought you quit. No, they are they are too long. That's Do you crazy. think these are too long? First of all, that's disgusting. Yeah, I don't have. I Those are shit shovels for your though. asshole. Yeah. Every time you wipe your asshole, you got four inches of Nutella under your nail. Cut it down. Quite oh, punk. that's right. Sorry. Oh, that's what you guys have in common. Oh, no. You don't either. <laughs> so, no, no, it's worse than you, it's worse than you think. Dum Dum took a shit in my bathtub. Oh, there's more of us. You people are sick. Get Jared, a Facebook a good group and it. kill yourselves. These Gosh, guys. stop, Jason. <laughs> shower hose is good. Yeah, the shower works. Yeah, don't shit in the tub. <laughs> well, whatever. Let us do what we want to do. <laughs> yeah, they go out to the Jared, woods, don't you, you agree? fucking animals. Yes. Yeah, let us fucking let me shit. Live, where, Jason. Yeah, let, me let live. us live. First of all, you know God. you can't side with him. You still have to face me. I got a knife in my hand. Yeah, it scares me. Y'all staying together. I picture you safest. being a real. It feels like an abusive relationship. Like there might be. Like we may need to free Jared from the yoke. He's of... never had Jared. It's so not. It's, a... it's like Stop you know. If you need, if you need help, just let us know, and we'll get you out of this. Because it seems like he's answering for you. He won't let you talk. Please he's tell us. Telling all these things. I mean, <laughs> please tell he's... us. Taking the... a place on my. Page therapist, so is that right? No, I'm cool. fucking right. joking that, that didn't even work, but no. Um, As your what therapist? Maybe that's why Jason's oh, jumping therapist. in and answering for him. Yeah. Now I see it. I was just um, trying to no, keep the no, conversation um, going. <laughs> yeah, where were we? Yeah, where were we? He knows not to answer that question truthfully, or he gets the back of Jason's hand. He's been very good, actually. He'll, he'll actually catch himself now... Because he's so in tune to my reactions to his horseshit <laughs> that now he's got PTSD from fucking up. So he's. That's not true, is it? Because you just started shaking have... a little there when you <laughs> PTSD was that. For so many That's epi- not true, is it? But it's for have... the right yeah. reasons. I have it for so many things. So it just. This is, yeah, this yeah. is, this is like business. Like that one time you were in the car and your foot was just on the. The break. <laughs> That's nothing, but yeah. I know, I know. That's even. No, no, no. It was all, yeah, I, yeah. Yeah, it's good. You didn't hit the yeah. gas. Mm-hmm. It's good. Yeah. But there are tons of movies where cars are breaking through walls and yes. going into trees. Dukes of Hazard. Yeah, Dukes of Hazard. You watch that one time. It's a it's a surprise anybody drives. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Did, Gosh. did J- Jason also make you pay to watch spare parts? No. No, I watched it on my own. For free? Oh, I have Amazon. I have my... S- this dude's Amazon account, so. Oh, nice. Oh, oh someone yeah. trying to help out Jared again. <laughs> I'm surprised Come you on, let sword. his sister help him out I with an Amazon account. I have my sister's Amazon account, dude. and my brother's Netflix, so. Oh, nice. So, yes. It's I, called being a good. con man. How does your brother, Running does he watch scam. cool stuff or dumb stuff? <laughs> what can I say on TV? No, um. Because you can tell what people have watched on Netflix. My brother watches a lot of, like, documentaries and shit. But okay, fair enough. He also lives in my mom's b- b- basement, so he's an interesting guy. <laughs> he's also 47. <laughs> Is he really? He's 30-something, but yeah. 30-something? He's the actual sp- best one in the family. He's what? No, I'm just making... He's an uh, asshole in the family? He's an actual disabled person because he's over 30 and lays my mom in the basement. <laughs> oh, I don't remember one because I knew yeah. that a long time ago. The actual disabled person. Yeah. yeah. I tell him that all the time, so. What does he say? Just fuck he you. hasn't spoken to me in a couple months, so. so. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Yeah. Until he changes that password, it's all good, brother. Exactly, you know? <laughs> yeah, what you are know? you going to do? Would you right. call him up and ask him for the password if he changed it? My mom my mom would give it 
to me, so it's all good. Cool, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, good. So you wouldn't really have to worry. No, no. So hopefully he does fucking change it. You could be like, Mom just gave me the new password, right. bitch. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Mom just gave me the new password, bitch. Exactly. <laughs> say it, say it. My mom gave me a new password, b- 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 bitch. Yep. <laughs> yeah. We pray for that, but yeah. Yeah. Not to even... <laughs> yeah, sorry, punk. Mom just gave you the new password. Yeah. The bitch line's great, though. <laughs> bitch? Yeah. Well... <laughs> That's most of the line. Yeah. Well, I hope your brother's doing okay. Though. No, he's good. He's good. He's all right. Cool. A lot of Canadians' uh, sons live in the basement because they've lost their jobs, so they've been forced to move back with their families. Yeah. Really? So now you've got the kids that never left to begin with and the kids who have come home because they've lost their careers and now I wonder how that mixture plays. it's not well mm. it's not well it's not well it's like an episode of mama's family yeah. you ever watch mama's family yeah the carol burnett spinoff <laughs> yeah. yeah was that a carol burnett spinoff yeah. Yeah, yeah 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 did you ever watch mama's family jared never even heard of if it. i showed you 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 might remember it but it wasn't Maybe. that popular was it I don't know. I just and it was character. It, it was like the, who was the actress who played uh, Vicky Lawrence? Vicky Lawrence, right? But she she, she wasn't lady. she wasn't that old. Mm. Yet I she's know. like it yeah, was, it was a Carol to... Burnett show sketch. Yeah, Mrs. It, and it looked like a, a long form Mrs. Doubtfire. Yeah, because in the sketch she was uh, Carol Burnett and uh, Harvey Corman's mom. That's right. They were Harvey Corman and Carol Burnett were married, and then Ma was Mama. Yeah, but I don't think. The Those theme song the was show. like, I remember yeah. Family Guy making a joke about it, and the theme song was like seven minutes long <laughs> was in the opening of the show. What does it yeah. sound like? Can you do it? No, I don't I even know the melody. It. I can't hold melodies Take or lyrics. Knock on our door. But knock on that, our door. That's okay, Three's okay, Company. Okay. No, that's Three's Company. That is yeah. We yeah, watch a lot of old The mama's kids family shows. is coming for you. His and hers and <laughs> I liked Eight is Enough. Did you watch Eight is Enough? That might be going back. A, 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 I don't remember Eight is Enough. It was a family of uh, that had eight adopted children, except a couple of blood siblings, and then they adopted like seven kids or something. A couple blood siblings? What is that, like a horror show? What is that? No, mean? cool name for a fucking blood blood band. <laughs> that's, a, that's a good band name, Blood Siblings. <laughs> that is... <laughs> Blood siblings. Jared, do that like we're part of blood sibling. <laughs> it takes Ooh. all the edge off with the Canadian flag in the background. <laughs> just, just three jackasses at a hockey game. That's what that looks like. Yeah. I want to go to a hockey game. I've never been to one. I've never been to one. You never have. I don't do hockey. What do you mean you don't do hockey? I don't do hockey. Look, it was uh that wasn't my uh thing. What were you I rollerblading? Sports. No, no. I almost <laughs> you turned said you rollerbladed I almost pushed over Jared you. on the ground because no, there's no rollerblading. Yeah. It's like you coming out of the closet to your family. It's not gonna happen. You're gonna live a lie. I'm not rollerblading. I can't believe you just brought that up. Are we recording? Yeah, this is recording. No, I was uh skateboarding BMX. That was my thing. Do you want to feel some metal? In my arm? Yeah. Feel this. So if you put your... <laughs> little you, squeamish. If you take my hand and put it on his ball. Ah! Hey! Oh, no, no. Oh, hold on. Hold I was on. about to touch no, your no, thing. Whoa, 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 whoa. Everyone relax. <laughs> this is going to take a minute. Don't <laughs> fuck this up. We're, this is show business. <laughs> so there's a pin uh, if you feel, and you can feel it through the coat. <laughs> And can you feel the end of that needle? Woo. That's steel right there. Why? You, I've heard never uh, anybody. <laughs> okay, 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 Stop. Okay. Okay. Oh, my God. Too much. I'm so worried when nobody else is around. It's just y'all two. I pray to God everything is all right. It's the safest place he could be. See, he's moving again. Uh, he's, and you see the way he answered real quick right there when you said that? Jason's like, oh, it's safe. It's safe. It's safe. <laughs> real quick answer. Get in the van. Right Get in the van. <laughs> No, it's the best place. Let yeah. us know, Jared. After the show's He's... over, just pu- uh, pull pull me aside help and say, on? "Just help, uh, just help. Give me a wink, whatever it is. Blink, <laughs> just blink. Help me." Jason's place is actually a safe space. Yeah, mm-hmm. 
Do what? What was that one? My place is a safe space. You, you felt that after not being in it for duration of time. But yeah. um but yeah. But you're, you're I bet also... it's a safe space. I bet it is. You've I been to my you house. have those devil candles all in, all in there. Oh yeah, there is fucking rituals going down on the regular. How do you think all this shit comes to their light? Jared, just don't start. Jared take... was standing next to a pile of dog shit in a field in Toronto two years ago doing comedy for a bunch of angry cunts in front of a university. That was fun. And I was like, "That's this is not the end of his career. He has to come to Austin. We had that talk like four years ago, right? Yeah. And I'm like, you got to, uh, there's no, you have nothing gotta left. You got to get out of Canada. You got to get out of Canada. And yeah. I said, kill Tony. And same with Walker. That Walker, was Texas Ranger. Sam, Sam Walker. Walker. Oh. Uh, Sam and uh, Jared are perfect for it and uh, they're, have they're huge success. Perfect for each other. Well, not only that, I can't wait to get these Jared and Sam in the same room in Austin doing what they do best. Is uh, it's it's just th Sam. And I just picture you pacing around in the background. No, I do all the ahead. screaming before we get there, and then I go get high. And yeah, talk let it people. out. Let it out. <laughs> yeah. yeah, let it out. I let it rip before we get there, and then he's on. He's totally set. Once you're there, you're fine. We go through everything, constantly. All right. Over well, reviews. Prepared. You prepared. Well, it was so nice for y'all to be here. So nice. Your to sweaty see hands. You. I know. I can't believe it. Shirt was clean. See. Shirt. I was not clean anymore. Okay. Well, your hands. Sorry. I'm joking. Yeah. Yeah, we both have sweaty hands. Yeah. Yours are warm though. Mine are cold. Yeah. You guys are very gross white guys. My hands are always cold. You guys, you guys are like sweaty cheese stop. on a stop. table. <laughs> Please stop. Like, you know what? This is it. You guys, Please this stop. is uh, my parents fucking watch. Craft singles. You guys remind me of just packaged cheese. Well, that's really wrapped sweet. in plastic. That's late. And we'll look at what Grant put up. The oh, ah, cats. Pretty oh. cool. I have siblings. Cats. You know how you new you album. <laughs> So I had where, golf shoes. And I where can them. people find you? I'm on Instagram at the one who underscore who stutters. The one underscore who underscore stutters on Instagram. I don't get it. <laughs> I'm kidding. Uh, the one who stutters. I don't. Under, yeah. yeah. And and Jerry Nathan comedy on YouTube. Cool. And yeah, that's what you can find. Yeah. Me. Finally, that YouTube channel. Yeah. Finally. Finally. Like, it's Finally. like you got to have a, because there's so many gaps in between live performances for stand up comedy now that feeding. In Canada, it sounds like. Yeah. Yeah. Canada's bad, man. It's really bad. I, my, my, uh, uh, I, the, uh, yeah. those poor bastards in Ottawa in the trucks, it's no joke. I can picture you being up there in one of those trucks. I can't handle that kind of shit. Once I see cops, I go nuts. <laughs> I just freak out, man. He hides. I'll pick he hides. up. He runs the other way, yeah. No, no, no. I would throw dead animals off a roof down on the police. You want to do medieval shit? <laughs> oh, god. We'll do it. And Jason, I think, where can people find you? Uh, Catch a Predator <laughs> episode that's coming up. <laughs> I'm uh, when I'm, this Tuesday? Uh, no, I'm in the big season finale. <laughs> uh, a, a special episode is called The Untouchable Touched. Ooh. Yeah. I eat the cookies. Featuring the Blood Brothers. But I don't. This is the thing. This is a double fuck because I'm not after the kids. I'm going to fuck the cameraman. Woo. Yeah. That's quite the twist. Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, it is quite the twist, especially when I take a shit on his chest. Oh. And, like the Dairy Queen. Gosh, like the dear nice. queen. You like ice cream? You guys hungry? We should all eat. You want to eat off the out of the ground, or off the garbage? Yeah. Can after those. Great. Maybe. <laughs> all right. Well, thank you all so much for being here. Thanks for having us, thank everybody. You. Bye, kitties. Get <laughs> 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 I almost passed out on that last one, <laughs> and I peed a bit. Is that blood? Thanks for joining us for this week's episode of The William Montgomery Show. Send your questions, artwork, and manifestos to the William Montgomery Show at gmail.com. Leave William a voicemail at 737-471-1098. 
Never miss an episode of The William Montgomery Show by subscribing to The William Montgomery Show channel on YouTube and anywhere podcasts are sold. Check out William online at william.f.montgomery1 on Instagram. For more William Montgomery, check out Kill Tony on YouTube and see him live at the Vulcan Gas Company in Austin, Texas every Monday night. For more of me, Brett Erickson, check out Issues with Andy on Patreon. Find me on Twitter and Instagram at iBrettMyPants. This episode of The William Montgomery Show was recorded at Permanent Record Studios right here in the heart of Austin. The William Montgomery Show is produced by William Montgomery and Brett Erickson. The William Montgomery Show is a Fanny Co. production. Thanks for joining us. See you next time. Shh, who the fuck said that? I'm trying to have fun tonight.